All right, what's up, man? We're just doing a simple installation here today. Actually, the door is fine. It's just that the previous installer, whoever that may have been, they installed this totally incorrect. I'm gonna show you. They use finished nails to install the framing, which that's the, that's the strong part of the door. And you'll see why this came off the hinges. I'm gonna show you now. The whole framing came out. Now, and as you turn it around, can you see this nonsense? If you back it up so you get a better view. They use finish nails. Now we know, finish nails you use for the molding, like inside your house, you know, the framing around your house, to hang a picture. You know, this ain't for structural stuff. Structural stuff, you need strong nails to go in the foundation to hold it strong. You understand what I'm saying? So whoever did this, this was a real lazy, sloppy job that it may have worked for temporary purposes. But as you can see, the finish nails was holding the whole framing. Nah, so now I gotta pop all these out. And I gotta put actual structural nails, screws rather. And I'm gonna drill it into it to hold this frame strong. And then we can put the door back. Nothing's wrong with the door, just the frame. And whoever did the frame, they use finish nails to hold. That is nonsense. All right. All right, so sorry. I did a not so great job this time as far as showing you step by step. But what we did was three inch structural nails for wood. So as you can see, I put two up here at the top and now we just finishing them off. I should have had a... Now these go in the structure. I pre-drilled, I pre-drilled, like I said, this little frame here is about an inch thick. So I went with three inch. So it's gonna go through the wood and it's gonna go through the structure another two inches. So now that's a solid, strong hole. And that's what you want. Now as you can see now, see how the door was, but see how it is now? Oh, trust me, it ain't going nowhere. It ain't going nowhere. And look, and she had, a lot of people deal with this here. Normally, I've seen it so many times. People open and close their door and it's always hitting at the top, which means whoever installed it, they didn't level it out. It's very important that you level it. You always have a good level. But look at it now, it's no more hitting. Nice and smooth, closed. No hitting at all. See, nice and smooth. What can help you sometimes to level, obviously you use a leveler, that way you make sure it's nice and level. But sometimes you wanna use little spacers in here and that will help you from the door because a lot of times what people do, they install the door, an uh, inexperienced person, let's just say, or let's not even go with inexperienced because we're not trying to offend the light. Let's just go with a beginner, right? They install a door and just because it look level, just because it look like it's in there nice and snug doesn't mean it is. And a lot of times when they have it in, they don't realize it'll slightly be like this. It'll be so minuscule that you don't even see it. And then once you get everything in, and it looks good, but then when you go to open and close, you keep going, you keep getting, you keep getting something like this, like crank, clank. And it's like, man, this door keep hitting. And you'll even see, if you come closer here, you can see. Come over this way. You can see how the previous on, see how it kept hitting? Look at the damage. Keep hitting now. If you go down here, you don't see it. See? When you go back up, you can tell this is where the door was hitting all the time. It would not allow them to shut. So now, what does that mean? Now a person got to, when they shut the door, they got to force it shut. Force it shut every time. Because improper insulation. So now, as I said, no more forcing the door shut. Nice and smooth. I got to put the spring on this one. See that? Nice and smooth. Locks right in place. No hitting. Nice, smooth open. Nice, smooth close. That's what you want, folks. Peace. All right, so this is the finished job, y'all. As you see, I just painted the screws there. Got a nice, sturdy finish now. As I said, you could you could pull on this. It's, it's not going nowhere before how it came out. And we fixed it. As I said, how her door was hitting. As you see the damage there. So we went to further length to fix that as well. Because if you're going to do a job, do it totally complete. Now the door shuts on its own. Before it did. Before, you know, like a lot of, I said a lot I of people. I have to pull it up. Yeah. Like, I'm sorry, no, no, you're fine. No. It's your girl. Because a lot of people, it, it always hit there. So now we avoid that by balancing it and it shuts. 
with ease. So here's the finished job. And that's it. Peace. Okay. And this is the young lady of the house. So she is all that. And that's it.